MrYorkieLoverFitness.com. Let's talk about Tom Brady's diet. For those of you who do not know, Tom Brady is the quarterback for the New England Patriots. He is 39 years old. He's been in the NFL for 16 years, and he's about to play in his seventh Super Bowl. And this year was his second best year stat-wise. Tom Brady follows an alkaline diet, and that is a belief that eating foods with a high or low pH will affect the pH of your blood in a significant way. Now his diet consists of 80% alkaline and 20% acidic. So he eats 80% vegetables and whole grains and 20% fish and lean meats and everything he eats is organic. Now here's what he doesn't eat. He doesn't eat sugar, white flour, nightshade fruits and vegetables which consists of tomatoes, peppers, eggplants, potatoes, and certain berries. No MSG, no salt, no coffee, no mushrooms, no dairy, limited alcohol, and he is gluten-free. His fat comes from extra virgin olive oil on raw foods and coconut oil on cooked foods. Now he says the reason he doesn't eat nightshade vegetables and fruits because he believes they cause inflammation in the body. If you look at Tom Brady, he does not look or act like he's 39 years old. So let's talk about the NFL. The average player lifespan in the NFL is six years. The average age of a starting quarterback is 28 years old. And like we said before, Tom Brady is 39 years old and he's one of the elite quarterbacks still playing in the NFL. Okay, so what we don't know is Tom telling the truth. So this is the diet he laid out and is what he's saying true or is there stuff he's taking that we don't know he's taking? The other thing is, does he use supplements to make up for the lack of vitamins and minerals in some of the uh, fruits and vegetables he's not eating? Will this diet work for everyone? We don't know. Many nutrition experts say this alkaline diet is BS. So who do we believe? Do we believe the experts or do we believe a guy excelling on this diet? I guess that's up for you to decide and research more. So go ahead and leave uh, some comments, questions, and I'd like to know what you guys think about this. Do you agree with the experts or do you agree with Tom Brady? If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.